And 19-year-old Lynn will break in the third frame. It's a good break off. Merlin Shrike. Right. But there's a possibility of a double on here. He'd be on the black. And he wouldn't believe in anything except the red he was playing on. Well, there was nowhere near that. Uh, perhaps the Paul career is on hold for the moment. I remember Stephen Hendry, for all his brilliance, saying that he was hopeless at doubles. Chance to open the reds up here, bring that cue ball back dead on the cushion behind the black. He could play the cue ball up into the balk area, and if he could get it somewhere round about, well, in between the, the yellow and the brown, dead on the cushion, or close to it. to have seen the cue ball closer to the cushion. This is worth taking on this red. Wait for it. It was closer to that pocket. Nice little rub on the red there. It leaves him a nice angle to open these reds. Check for any plants. Beautiful. Anybody hurt? Six. They've split nicely. And he has a red to the right corner. Just depends if you can get to a colour from it. A delicate cannon needed, maybe. Seven. Delicate cannon got. Held nicely for the black. And what a chance now. Nothing can they can do but just sit there and hope.
Rob Milkins is now level with Mark Joyce at one frame all. Winner of that match to play the winner of this one. 31. Crowd gripped by the action. He sense that Mark Selby is beginning to find his stroke. Oh dear. Well, there was nothing to show her as soon as Phil said that, that he was going to miss one. Well, he seemed to snatch at it, didn't he? It was a routine black. Let's have another look at this. Did he get a kick because he missed it by some distance? I can't believe that he did miss it by that distance. It had to be a kick, that surely. Well, that was unforeseen. One. Yes, not an easy table, this, though. Four red safe. And this pink, not a gimme. It was a poor positional shot he played there, Link. Although, if this does go in... It's handy to have that pink back on its spot. Well, straight back at the table, Mark Selby, and that's just what the doctor ordered. Forget all about that black now. Lynn was missing that pink by quite a distance. Wasn't easy. It could well have cost him this third frame. This last loose red should be enough to win in the frame. Seventeen. Red and pink will suffice. Eighteen. crowd know that was the key ball. 24. Yes, he'd like to see this one disappear as well, though, just to make sure. Who's and ours as the red stays on the table, and that will encourage Lynn to battle on. Just the one snooker required. It's not vintage, Selby. Yes, I expected him to pot that red. It was touching the cushion. Maybe he took it a little too easy. Oh dear. 
It won't matter now, though, because uh, Lynn misses the black off its spot and concedes immediately. So Mark Selby has done enough to get what was another scrappy third frame on the board. He edges 2-1 in front from 1-0 behind. He needs three more for a place in the round of 16. And frame four is coming up next.